This fall and winter season is all about chunky shoes. And if you guys wanna know what shoes those are that are gonna be available for you and that are totally wearable, then keep watching this video. You might be a little bit surprised by some of these. Hey guys, my name is Jamie and thank you so much for coming to my channel. Today I wanna talk to you about shoe trends for this coming fall and winter season. And y'all, I was surprised about some of these and you might be too. So I would love to know what you think of some of these trends as I talk about them. Leave me in anything in the comments that comes to your mind. Maybe you've worn them before and just don't wanna do that again or wore them before and really love them and will wear them again. Whatever it is, then I would love to hear about it, and I would love to hear your opinion. And if there's anything that's not on here that you're going to love for fall and winter that I haven't talked about, cause there will be some that I don't talk about I would love to know that too so just let me know in the comments below and one word that sums up this season is chunky most of the shoes you are going to see are going to be chunky whether they have a block heel that's a little bit chunkier or they might be on a little bit of a platform and then they also might have a lug sole so you're going to see a lot of classic styles come out with a little bit chunkier um, soles on them and that is just what is in for this season and it's been trending a little bit you know each season coming forward maybe last fall and the previous fall was a little bit chunky because the block heels were really big but now we're getting into the platforms you saw a lot of them at the runway shows a lot of platforms and a lot of lug soles so that's trickled down and they're actually not as chunky and not as platformy if that's a word <laughs> that they as they were on the runway shows but they are still in stores everywhere so the first one I want to talk about I was really surprised about and I was kind of hoping it wasn't going to be in style but it is and it may be here to stay I'm not sure but it's clogs and you may have done this trend before like me and I'm not sure I'm ready for it but I do think the styles that are out are really cute they have done some really fun colors and some animal prints on them and so there are also ones that are available with lower um, not even a platform it's just more of a flat sole or you could do more of the chunkier platformy sole that they have that is wood and i'm hoping that they have gotten a little bit smarter and made some of these out of a more comfort sole maybe a more rubbery sole that looks like wood that's not actually wood because i do think that that wood is really uncomfortable but it kind of takes away from the look of a clog if you don't have the wood sole so we'll see what we find i couldn't tell i think some of these most of these have a wood sole but some of them didn't even the ones that look more like a birkenstock style clog um, have a little bit of a softer sole so those could be nice and i think those could be a great option if you're like me and don't really dig that um, hard wood sole but i do like the look i think it's cute and i think they've done a good job at giving them a little bit more of a modern look so the next one really surprised me and i would love to know your opinion on this but cowboy boots y'all cowboy boots are supposed to be trending and i know this trend goes in and out it may not stick around but that western style has been around for a while um, a few seasons ago that western style influence and in booties was really big and boots so you will see that still and if you don't want to go full-on cowboy boot just do that western style boot that's what i have and i do like the cowboy boots i think they're fun i think it just brings out the country girl in me because i did grow up in a small town and i even wore what we called ropers i don't know if you're familiar with ropers but i wore those when i was in high school they were the thing and so i really do love some of these styles especially the ones with the fringe i think they are super cute so let me know what you think the next trend are slouch boots and then i'll mention two because i've got two in this photo slouch boots and knee-high boots and so slouch boots have been coming on the scene for a little while. I really love the look of slouch boots. I actually have a pair that's very similar to the Free People one in the center here where it's just got the little bit of slouchy 
right at the curve of your ankle on top of your foot. And I do love the ones that kind of slouch on the sides. I think this is a cute look with lots of different things in the fall and with some skinny jeans and a, you know, the chunky knit sweater. I think that looks going to be really cute. And then the knee high boots, I've talked about knee high boots before and knee high boots are going to be very popular with wearing short dresses with and either have bare legs or tights on. And then these are also great with your skinny jeans, especially if you live somewhere where it's really cold and you need to layer and bundle up. I think a knee high boot is perfect. And you're going to see mostly black heels on these and some lug soles, which you'll see here. So the knee high boots, I think everyone can get on board with. They've kind of been around in a classic style for a while and they just have different looks each season and this season of course it's a little bit chunkier and you'll see one has a little bit of, of a western flair to it the tan boot in the photo and that one is available at the Nordstrom anniversary sale if you want to snag it uh, the one in the center the gray one is as well so now let's talk about the chunkiest of them all in my mind which is combat boots so combat boots are the thing right now basically <laughs> These are the chunkiest, the lug soles, what they're pushing. And y'all, combat boots have been around for a few fall seasons now. And this season, I think, is the most popular. I think it goes with a lot of the current styles, that kind of grungy look. Um, you can wear them really great with flare jeans, skinny jeans, even the straight legs that you can roll up. And I think this look kind of goes with the season. And you can find some that aren't so chunky, that don't have as much of a lug sole. And I've given you a few options. And y'all, I really love the white ones. I know it's winter time. You can wear white shoes. White shoes have been trending for winter, uh, fall and winter for a few fall and winters now. So I do love the white ones. So keep an eye out for that. Find ones, like I put one on here, which is by Kate Spade at the bottom. It's more of a fabric material, which was really cute. I thought a little bit more feminine, but still has that chunky look. And if you don't want so, so chunky, you could go with something like that. And I think it looks really great. And it just laces up and it's just a fun thing that you can wear with just about anything. So the next one I want to talk about are loafers, and then I'll talk a little bit more on lug soles. So loafers have been trending as well, and this season the chunky loafer is really big for that flat, just easy shoe. And to me, it gives them a little bit more of a sporty look. So I don't think I would do this with like your uh, workwear or anything like that. I would wear them with jeans or even a maxi dress something a little bit more sporty looking even you know some of your leisure wear if you found the right one and the three I put on here they have varying levels of chunkiness as you'll see in a lot of shoes so just choose what you're comfortable doing and what you would wear and a flat loafer without the chunky shoe is also really popular so if you don't want that chunky look although it's in this season then just go for a regular loafer and then the lug soles. So I put lots of examples here because even the sneakers are going to have a little bit of a platform which makes it a little bit more of a lug sole. And then you even have the platform boots that you'll see with the um, block heels and then the front has the chunkier platform on it. And so I just wanted to give you some examples of those, the, those that I've been seeing, and there's lots of them out there. There's lots of varying degrees of chunky that you can do. And so just choose what floats your boat, what you will wear and what you love. And I love the platform sneakers. I'm not sure that I would do like a platform boot or even a platform loafer or anything like that, but I do love the chunkier soles in a minimal chunk. Um, I don't like the really heavy chunky for myself, but if it works for you and you can style your outfit to go with that chunky shoe, then I say go for it. And if you do love that look and don't know how to style it, I'll be glad to do a video. Just let me know in the comments if you want to know how to style chunkier shoes because 
you do have to do it a little bit differently. But this season with everything being more oversized and the clothing is looser, which you'll see a lot. If you're wearing skinny jeans, you're probably going to wear an oversized button down, a shirt jacket, or even a um, cable knit heavier sweater. And I think the chunkier shoes help balance that look. And so I do think they fit in really well with the season. And I think you have a ton of options of how chunky you actually want to go. So that sums up all of my shoe trends for fall and winter season that I love. And I would love to know what you think and what you think you'll be wearing and maybe what you will absolutely not be wearing <laughs> because I know there's probably something in there like that. But I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, I would love for you to give me a thumbs up. It really helps my channel. And also subscribe if you have not and want to keep up with my weekly videos. And I would love it if you would check out my online style subscription. If you haven't heard of it, it's called Your Guide to Style, which is the name of this YouTube channel. And the reason why I do this is because I love styling women. And I created an app with my husband online that you can log into from any device and get style advice. You can find outfits that are created with a lot of these shoes as well in the fall. So I would love for you to check it out. If you want to just go to our website at www.yourguidetostyle.com and I'll also provide you a link below. We have all the information about what the app is all about on our website. So I hope you will check it out. And thank you so much for watching and I will talk to you next week.